breaking news. Welcome to today's headlines. Creek war breeze in Ninja Delta. Azasari Dokubolo poses Tompolo's 4.5 billion Naira pipeline contract. Creek war breeze in Ninja Delta. Azasari Dokubo opposes Tompolo's 4.5 billion Naira pipeline contract. So, my dear listeners, from wherever you're listening from, please stay tuned as I read to this news. A drum of war is sounding in the Niger Delta region following the decision of a foremost freedom fighter and founder of the Niger Delta Volunteer War Force, NDVF, Asari Dokubo. To oppose the 4.5 billion Naira monthly pipeline surveillance contract awarded a former militant leader, I Chief Government, Ekwemo Polo Eke Tompolo. The aggrieved Tokubole in a viral video said it's marked of greed for Tompolo to be in charge of pipeline protection for all the ethnic groups in the Niger Delta. Dokubo wondered why Tompolo would be in charge of Delta. Bayasa River State querying whether he was the only one that knew how to heat. He vowed to stop Tompolo from being in charge of the surveillance contract for the 83 km pipeline crease crossing his Calabari area in River State. Dokubo said he would not allow Tompolo's armed boys escorted by soldiers to enter the Calabari area. The Creek warlord accused the Minister of State for Petroleum, Chief Timmy Prey Silva, of deliberately giving everything to Tompolo to spite him and destabilize the Niger Delta. He said by giving all the pipeline contract to only Tompolo, Silva was only interested in causing confusion for the government in the region. Dokubo said, You will take pipeline contract in Delta State, your place, and then you come to Calabari to take another one, saying you are an Ijoman. Because you are the only one that knows how to heat. You took the ones that belong to Baramatul Itsekiri, Itsoko, Urobo, Kuale. You took all because you are the only one that knows how to heat. You went to buy us and took everything, then you came to take the one in Calabari. If Timmy Prey Silver gave you because he said he wanted to clip my wings as if he were a god. When Silver was a member of the House of Assembly, did I clip his wings? I am older than Silver. When he was a governor, did I clip his wings? He is now a minister, did I clip his wings? Silva said I was becoming too powerful and connived to give pipeline contract to only Tompolo so that it would destroy what we are doing for the government he serves. We are making the government to be stable, but he is destabilizing the same government he serves. So he brought Tompolo gathered people saying he would buy guns for them. Let them come. I am not boasting. Let soldiers bring the Tompolo boys here. I am not talking about rivers. I am saying they cannot take Calabari. They can take every other place, but I won't allow them to take Calabari. You are collecting over 4.5 billion Naira a month for doing nothing.
and people are supporting you you must leave the 82 kilometer pipeline for calabari you can't take it take all other place but this one in calabari you can't take it have you heard that since we started fighting army hadn't had my camp before but is on within three days iroko was destroyed and camp 5 was destroyed till today Ami was still occupying camp 5. Ami has never entered any of my camps before. I live inside camp close to Lami people. Dokubo faulted Tompolo's mission, saying he was only fighting for the protection of Baramatul and not for the interest of the Ijo nation. He said, I can't compare myself to Tompolo. It is unimaginable that I will condescend to the level of Tompolo who is Tompolo. What is antecedent? Don't allow me open a car of worm. What Ijo struggle is Tompolo fighting? Is he even involved in Ijo struggle? He is fighting war with Itsekiri. He has never been in Ijo struggle. Baramatu versus Itsekiri, that is the war he is fighting. He is not even involved in Ijo people who are fighting like Obe Ijo. Obe Ijo had been fighting with Elaje. Has Tompolo gone there before? Is he in Ijo struggle? Show me one place he has done anything in Ijo land. So Baramoto's struggle is Ijo struggle. What development has it brought to his area? Come and see my place and see what is happening there. The Maritime University, the fourth, under good luck to bring, up to now, is the university recognized by law. A drum of war is sounding in the Niger Delta region. Following the decision of a foremost freedom fighter and founder of the Niger Delta Volunteer Force, NDVF, Asari Dokubo, to oppose the 4.5 billion naira monthly pipeline surveillance contract awarded the former militant leader i chief government ekwe mumpolo aka tompolo to my dear listener now i've come to the end of our today's news please do drop by the comment section and let's